What's going on guys, Dom247 here, and I'm going to be showing you today how to make your own capacitive touchscreen stylus with stuff that you probably already have at your house. Okay, so you're going to need a couple different things for this. One of those being a sponge, uh, slightly damp. If you use a sponge that is totally dry, it's not going to work. So I just have a piece of sponge here that I cut off that I found in the kitchen. Second, you're going to need a pen that you can take apart. And lastly, you're going to need a paper clip. So the way we're going to do this is uh, you got to take the guts out of the pen, the guts of the pen out. Works easier if you use some kind of pliers or something. So we're just going to take the tip out here. Be careful not to break it. You will need it later. Oopsie. So there's that. Here's the, <laughs> didn't need to use the pen. Uh. So what you're going to want to do before you put the sponge into the pen uh, you need a hole for the paper clip to go into the pen to touch the sponge, just to touch it. Uh, so you're either going to need a small drill bit, uh, which would probably be the easiest way to do it, or you need, um, in my case I have a nail and a lighter, so don't try this at home um, unless you are supervised, but uh, I actually don't even need the nail. I'm just going to use the paper clip I'm using. Just gonna throw the paper clip here in the pliers as to not burn my fingers. And I'm gonna use this uh, torch lighter here to heat up the uh, the tip of the paper clip. That's getting good and hot. You can see it's starting to get red there. Okay, so I'm just going to put this straight through my, uh, there we go, just straight into my tube here. You can see that it's uh, right in there. Sorry, I'm trying to do this all backwards. Okay, so now I've got the paper clip snugly in there. Now we just need to let it cool off. Make sure it's good and cold. You don't want your uh, sponge to melt. Well, you need the sponge to go past this. So what we're going to do is we're going to take our sponge, fold it in half here, kind of twist it up so that it's uh, a little thinner. That way we can just kind of push it right into the tip here, like so. Kind of. I can pull the paper clip back out now that I uh, have my hole. We'll just twist this sponge in. As you can see, it's going into my stylus here. And I'm going to leave it open a little bit. Just want to get these corners tucked in. Make it look a little more decent. There we go. So that's what our tip looks like now. Let that focus. That's our tip and there's a little hole. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my paper clip, push it into the hole right here, just so that it's touching my uh, sponge. You can really get it in there good. And now we want to test it to make sure that it works before we uh, go any further. So make sure you're touching the metal and you should be able to use it just like so. Okay, so that means everything's working. Now we're just going to open up our paper clip here. And we don't need all of this. So I'm going to clip a portion of it off. Right about here. That's good. 
just let that fly wherever it will. And now we're going to gently bend it, kind of make it look as good as you can around our pen here, just like so. And when you use a stylus, you're going to need to be touching this, um, this portion, this, this metal here. So now, we'll just take our uh, mobile device or our uh, capacitive touchscreen device and now we can uh, use this pen uh, to control our screen. Oop. Just like so. Use it to uh, browse the internet if we'd like or uh, to draw. Just tap in here. I can type something quite precisely. Oops. Sorry, I'm trying to do this on the inverse though. And there you go. Now you have your own stylus. I can show you guys here uh, an app. Where is it? Here we go. Board. And we'll just uh, pick white here, biggest size. We'll just draw, write something here. So it's pretty accurate. That's good. Let me just erase this here. Or we can shake to erase everything. Oops. Well, that is my uh, my new stylus. Just our metal thing on there and our tip. Thanks guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.